Well, finally, a new version of an old fairy tale. And Neil Pursley visited Stages Theatre Company in Hopkins for a preview of The Nightingale. Beautiful, beautiful nightingale. Maybe you've never heard the fairy tale of The Nightingale by Hans Christian Andersen, but since its publication in 1843, the tale has been adapted to opera, ballet, television drama, and in the case of Stages Theatre, with the help of Escalate Dance and Osseo, a musical stage production. It's our sixth year of doing this, so um, Sandy and I have been working together on this for six years, and it's the highlight of my year. The story is about a village where the mayor king holds a festival of progress. The people build a mechanical nightingale that, that kind of comes in as competition to the uh, real nightingale, and that's where the main the main um, conflict in the show comes from. The mayor falls in love with the dazzling mechanical nightingale that he values more than the real thing until he becomes deathly ill. And the beautiful song of the real nightingale is the only thing that can cure him. Sweet nightingale. Ali Kiwat plays the nightingale. But it's really relevant because it shares a message of the balance of technology and living in the moment, so it's not outdated. Technology can sometimes take away from like how beautiful the planet is, so I think I think sometimes we focus too much on our screens and not enough on, on how beautiful, especially Minnesota. Uh, nature good, technology bad. We didn't want to say that because um, there are benefits to both. This is a beautiful show and extremely well choreographed. You are just going to come away feeling like just amazing, like you've seen this really great play and you've heard a really great message which is about humanity and community. From Stages Theatre in Hopkins, Neil Pursley, CCX News. And the Nightingale runs through the weekend. For showtimes and tickets, you can go to stagestheater.org.